According to the Washington Post, in the past 10 years, assault-style rifles have been used in 14 public mass shootings. Half of those have occurred since last June. Our Chris Welty's live in studio, Chris, is the AR-15 classified as an assault rifle? Acadiana Gunworks says the AR-15 is a powerful gun, but it is not classified as an assault rifle. An assault rifle, by definition, is fully automatic fire. Despite not being as dangerous, anyone can purchase this gun even if you have no experience handling a gun. When a trigger is pulled on an AR-15, only one bullet is fired, not multiple. The AR-15 is a gas-operated semi-automatic rifle. Glenn Fleming is vice president of Acadiana Gunworks. He says an AR-15 is no different in design than a modern hunting rifle. One interesting fact of the AR-15, it actually fires a small 5.56 bullet that is full metal jacket. The, say, 7.42, Remington 7.42, fires a 30-odd-6 round that is actually has a ballistic tip and is way, does way more damage than the full metal jacket. The bigger bullet in a 742 is used to end the life of a hunted animal quicker. Fleming says it's a popular gun in the sportsman paradise state. The AR-15 is still selling well. And people use them for anything from planking to hunting to uh, matches like three gun matches. Anyone can purchase an AR-15. The buyer has to go through a strict background check with the FBI. We're the first line of defense as far as somebody who shouldn't have a gun not having a gun. Acadiana Gunworks says responsibility falls on the owner when they have a gun. Anyone thinking about making the purchase should do a lot of research and attend safety classes. Reporting live in the studio, I'm Chris Welty for Acadiana's KLEF News.